Just practice a little bit, a little nervous here and there, but now I'm just comfortable. I'm just out there playing football. Has there been anything that surprised you about just sort of the, the, the way the, the locker room vibe is like or maybe the chatter of practice, how fast practice goes, anything like that? I wouldn't say it was a surprise, more of just something just to get adjusted to. Like I said, we came from a, um, an air raid office at PD, so I mean, I'm so I'm used to the hand signs and the tempo and all that stuff, so that doesn't really throw me off as much. But more of just, it's just a different level of maturity. And I feel like I'm adjusting to it pretty well. And um, a lot of the older boys and some of the younger ones as well, like uh, the freshman class I was here last year, they've been helping me a lot. And a lot of the older boys like JJ and Gabby and all of them, a lot of the boys are helping me too. Nate, they all, so I mean, everything's going pretty good. They're helping me a lot with the transition. I feel like I'm handling it pretty well as well. Cool. And Alex said you guys are going a little bit slower than, than other dudes. Obviously, there's a lot of critiquing going on. What are some of the critiques that you've gotten so far? Uh, really just keeping my depth, just knowing I'm going to rush the thing, uh, just taking my time, just being comfortable. What do you got? I'm sorry to interrupt you, Jordan. Right, keep, keep going. That's my bad. I jumped the route. Uh, <laughs> what, what are you guys actually doing in practice? I mean, is like they're getting ready to try to play a bowl game, obviously, in a couple of days. I mean, are you guys sort of off to the side? Or are you actually able to get in, like, true practice reps with, yeah, like, so, the second and third stringers? Uh, the first day, of course, we got to do the acclimation stuff. But now we're, like, full on. We're in team period and all that. We're not – we're with the uh, second group. And we've been uh, giving the scout team a look as well, running with the second group as well. So just being able to give a lot of those older boys that are more comfortable, giving them time to rest for the bowl game. So we kind of plopped in, took their spot a little bit during practice and being able to get the game, the game rest that we can, like, grow from going into spring ball and also just being able to let them rest their bodies so we can be as close to 100% to win this game. Who do you see yourself developing into? Obviously, Jordan Ship, <laughs> one of one. But like, is there are there guys you look up to that you try to pattern your game after? Um, I would say one here, uh, JJ. I like what he does. JJ is a really good receiver. I've been watching him for a while. Um, you know, he, uh, I just been watching I mean, all the Chapel Hill games that I've been to. He's always been in. So I mean, uh, he's always been the outside receiver. So I mean. I feel like a lot of stuff, like especially now that I'm here with him, I'm trying to take as much stuff as I can from him. Cause I mean, he's doing great. He's dominating. He's started for a long time. I mean, he's doing what he's doing. And, uh, so I'll say, for, like for here, I'll say him for sure. And he's a good guy to learn learn under too. Yeah, he's, he's always been a good dude with he's us. He's a good so. person too. That's somebody yeah. that like, I've grown with really closely in a very quick time, and uh, definitely somebody I'll call a good brother for sure. That so, deep post. Oh, sorry. The deep post to JJ. You know that yeah. that that'll go. <laughs> Yeah, just take me through some of the wristbands here. You got a good amount of Oh, yeah, so uh, this right here is our uh, quarterback this year at my high school PD, Zayi Watt. He's pretty good. This is just like his little – some. I got uh, two of them. I got a uh, blue right here. There was and a then, handle on there. Yeah, this yeah. is Instagram. Go he's all right. Watt, <laughs> Zayi. He's, pretty, he's pretty good. <laughs> and then, of course, I got my Apple Watch. I keep my Apple Watch on me. This is my uh, PD band. It's old and rubbed off. Uh, another, yeah, yeah, another Carolina band, and then this right here is my uh, FCA band. Uh, it's just pretty much just um, I'm a big believer, so really just something just you can read anytime I walk by faith, not by sight, and it's just something that means a lot. And then this right here is just a uh, rival uh, rival band. I had to do some stuff with them, so they sent me some stuff. And then this is um, oh how uh, save a grow uh, grow a mo save a bro. This is um, something we do at PD. For, um, like a lot of money. Cause. It's a cause. I forgot what it is. It's, um, it's no shave November, but it's for something. And, um, so at PD, all the, all the boys, all the men, nobody shaves. It's just everybody just lets it grow. Everybody gets the bands. Then a Carolina football band. Oh, and then this right here. This is uh, one of the team, one of the high school teams, the Country Day. After we beat them, they gave me a band. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, so, and then uh, okay. I got another PD band right here. It's just. Uh, 2024 in my class, and then this is my overtime OT7 band you got for playing in, and then another Carolina band, another PD band, and then of course the uh, Keep Swing and Tyler band. There you go. It's going to give you a run for the money with the. I just have one. I have a rainbow loom <laughs> my daughter makes. <laughs> Thank you. You guys, good luck. Appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. All right.